Hey guys, welcome back to another great tutorial. I'm gonna show you how to publish your Fortnite Creative UEFN game. So what I recently did is import my Omega Pyramid gun game from the Fortnite Creative 1.0 and I moved it into UEFN. The first question I had was, wait a minute, okay, I tested it, it's working, I just wanna publish it. How do I do that? It took me a while to figure out but after gathering some resources, I figured it out. So let me share that with you. So what you're gonna to wanna to do is go to project and you're gonna scroll down to upload to test code. So you have to upload the test code first. You're gonna hit upload. You're gonna hit save selected. It's going to upload to test code. This is how you publish a map in UEFM. It is a lot more complicated than it was in Fortnite Creative 1.0. Now we're gonna wait for this to complete. Once it's completed, it creates a private code for us. We're gonna go ahead and hit done. Because I had that checkbox marked, it is bringing up the fact that I do have the code right here ready to go and I can publish this code. However, if you hover over this, it's going to say, hey, you actually can't publish this code. You need to run a memory calculation in UEFN first. My brain went, what? So <laughs> figured that out as well. So you're gonna scroll down here and it's gonna say launch memory calculation, but it's grayed out. Why is that? You actually have to have a session running to launch memory calculation. So we're gonna launch session first and we're gonna wait for that to launch. Just be patient guys. It can take longer than expected to launch a session. So just make sure you hold tight. It can take anywhere between one minute all the way up to sometimes seven minutes. So just be patient. So now you notice here I'm launched into a session so I'm gonna actually just leave that running there and I'm gonna go back over here to project and launch memory calculation. This can take some time. You can see the progress here in the actual Fortnite game. Now waiting for a memory calculation can also take anywhere from a minute up to seven minutes. So you're gonna be waiting again. It's not like the old days of 1.0, you hit publish and you're done. You have to do a lot of waiting and calculating and getting everything prepped then you'll see at the very end here, I get a memory calculation result. I am under the 100K limit, which is great. So I'm gonna hit continue. If I head over to my islands, I have way too many Omega Pyramids. You'll see down here at the bottom. So now when you click on your island, it will show up here and you should see something under private versions. So I was running some earlier tests. That's why you see this earlier one here, but this is the one we just did. So. When we're ready, we'll go ahead and just hit the publish button at that point. We'll update anything we need to and then hit submit for publishing. Because the title has to be all in one name like this, you're just gonna wanna make sure you space it out when you go ahead and launch your title and then hit submit for publishing. Once you go ahead and submit for publishing, you can either have it release automatically or you can hold it for release so you can review the release before it goes out to the public, which is actually pretty cool. In this case, I'm gonna go ahead and hold it for release only because I don't want this to be my final release. When you're done, you're gonna get this awesome public release submitted for publishing. And guys, that is it. That is how you publish in UEFN. If you have any questions, let me know below. Also, if you think that I'm doing a good job, hit the like button and subscribe. Until next time, talk soon.